I never really tell his story, but I'm going to tell it, right? <laughs> tell it, baby. Me and Peyton had an issue in the game against Jacksonville, right? And this was in the early 2000s. And luckily, there wasn't cell phone cameras and all that stuff as heavy as it is now, Instagram and all that stuff. We playing against Jacksonville. Jacksonville scores at the end, basically about to win the game. We got like 30 seconds left. I'm sitting on the sideline. I'm just looking on the field, looking at Jacksonville's side and looking at them celebrate. I'm like, damn, we're about to lose this game. I only had like 32 yards. Um, I'm just like, damn, like, I'm mad. You know, I just feel like I, I didn't – I didn't contribute the way I wanted to. So I'm not knowing that they huddling down there as an offense, right? So I'm just sitting there and I hear somebody like, hey, Rich, no Peyton wants you. You know what I'm saying? So I'm like, oh, okay. So I start walking down there and I, I see Peyton, I see Peyton saying something, right? I didn't <laughs> like what he had to say. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I didn't like what he had to say. Yeah. Hold on, so you so, walking down? Or is it me? So, it's so like yeah, body so, language. So, so, yeah, I'm, I'm looking. I'm like, I know this mother ain't talking to me like that. Oh, he talking to you? I, yeah, he talking to me. Mm. So I'm like, I know I'm grown, bro. So my first reaction was to react. Go back, <laughs> go back, go back to Louisiana. Bro, and you exactly. Can't react to I it. went. <laughs> it, it was, it was, it was. New Orleans on New Orleans right here because Peyton's from New Orleans. Yeah. So, so I push Peyton on the sideline. A lot of people don't even know that. You push Peyton man. Yeah, like, <laughs> like Chuck, bam! So to, to the point to where you got, you know, Brandon Stokely, Jeff Saturday, Tark Glenn, everybody. Edrin just looking over there smiling with them gold teeth. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? He's just smiling. What? Marvin Harrison sit up there like, he's shaking his head like, you know what I'm saying? That day, right, it was funny. I pushed Peyton, they separated us, we lose the game. You know, we, next, the next morning, uh, you know, me, Peyton, and Coach Dungey, you know, we talked about it, it was over with, whatever, whatever, right? But, but at the end of the day, and I know I went off from topic, you know, but Peyton, he had his moments, but I think it was kind of like how you're saying with Mike, to, to inspire the people who were not like starters. You know what I'm saying? What I do. Hey.